one image that will always be with me is you going, do you want to, and then disappearing, just an acceleration into a space with the ball. How much did you plan that? How much was natural? How much just became, I know I can do this, and I'll switch into top gear now? No, I can say one thing. There's one thing, especially in Spain, you, 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 you will know it because you've been here for many years. I said, uh, Michael, he, was, he, he made the croqueta. That means using the ball from one f foot to the other one to push it forward. And that I used, that was something natural because I think that I can make the dribble and I push like in, in, in billiard or something, I, I push it from, from, actually from my right to my left and then when the ball goes I push that forward. So immediately I'm already, I'm in the move with the ball. So I use it as a, as a movement to get forward, to get past my opponent, but in the same moment to get forward. Because one thing is to, in one against one, to make the dribble, but if you stay there, the opponent will be there, will still be there. So I use that. And then I've seen that other players who then uh, used it. Well, uh, Iniesta has been fantastic uh, with this one, but also other, other players uh, younger than me, they, they have used that to get forward. And sometimes, even players who are not fast, when they do it fast, they look, they actually look fast. And I think Iniesta is a great example. He was not a very fast player, but he looked fast because he was a fast thinker. Zinedine Zidane is another one that you are, you are, you are saying. So, the, but it it came natural, um, like other things. Um, so again. Um, I think I did it two very famous th uh, things in, in Spain, one with Romario and the other one with Raul, and then I made a third one with the World Cup in 98 where I just lifted it over. And, and I was asked, how, why did you do that? How did you, in, did you train that? And I said, no, but there was no space on the ground because there were so many defenders there. So the only way I could get the pass through was to put it on top of the, the players and, and it, it came like that. Did you, well, you've got a good mind in life and in football. Just having a, a sharp, intelligent mind match with peripheral vision, which you talked about, and skills, this will yeah, give you Yeah, but this. again, that was, I have to, I did not have that at that level when I was, when I was young. That just to say that you have to have the basics to do the things technically and all that, but then you have to develop them.